You may have heard the report. Mayor Koch confirmed it today that he is planning to expand the economic rights of homosexual couples who work for New York City. This has been a big issue with gay political activists. The mayor's executive order will affect some 30,000 people, not only gay couples, but also heterosexual couples who are not married but living together. Perry Pels reports. It's been an issue the gay community has been fighting in behalf of for years. They want gay and lesbian relationships to be recognized by the government, allowing them to qualify for new health and death benefits. Today at the annual Feast of Our Lady of Mount Carmel, Mayor Koch said he plans to issue an executive order that will not only recognize gay relationships, but all domestic partnership relationships. The uh, domestic partner who is... Um, in a family relationship uh, with a city employee will be allowed uh, to uh, get bereavement rights so that if uh, their uh, domestic partner dies they'll be able to take off the same amount of time that those who are now married are able to take off for their children and uh, for their spouses. Alan Klein is with the AIDS activist group ACT UP. Klein applauds the idea of such an order. He feels it adds a dimension of acceptability to gay and other unmarried couples. Absolutely. It's the first step to um, really guaranteeing that um, people in non-traditional family settings have rights that uh, others have been guaranteed for a long time in this country. Koch was hardly alone at today's Brooklyn Festival. All sorts of political candidates came out to campaign, including several of the mayoral candidates. The mayor, mayoral however, candidate Richard uh, Ravage he said he'd have to consider the economics, but he's basically in favor of this type of plan. I believe that uh, the rights ought to be accorded out of uh, decency and compassion within the context of the law uh, that are reasonable uh, and don't impose any significant public burden. City Comptroller Jay Golden says he's in favor, but he says he's curious about the mayor's motives. One wonders about why it's being done in an election year with just two months to go until the primary. It's what I've done in my office for a very long time. The mayor says his order will be issued within several weeks. He says the city still needs to work out the details of the plan, including which prerequisites will be required of a couple in order to qualify for the benefits. Perry Peltz, News 4, New York. On the subject of the benefits, bereavement benefits would take effect once Koch issues his order. However, insurance benefits will have to be secured during contract bargaining with the city union.